Hello guys and girls and welcome back to whatever the fuck this is And today I'm going to talk about how to create a good YouTube channel that will keep both you and your viewers interested and coming back for more Alright guys, and uh, I'm going to use an analogy for this one <laughs> And I've called it the web and I've just thought of it this morning while having a shower <laughs> Shut the fuck up, it's tried and tested shh, shh. Just listen, hear me out right, hear me out Every web has a strong core, okay And that's exactly what you need for your channel, okay A very strong core, a core mission, a goal, whatever you want to call it but something, the main reason why you're on this fucking website, after all, you need one reason, okay? Just a core goal, and that is your core for your web, okay? And then what do webs do? Webs spin out, don't they? Webs go out in all different directions for the support. And the support is the different um, videos that you do, okay? No. Think of each little point on this web as the different type of video that you do. So let's call them your playlists, okay? So you've got different playlists, okay? And these are all connected through the different ways of doing it, through your annotations, through your cards, through your end card, through your cross promotion of your other vlogs, okay? That's the support for this layer, okay? Your different types of, um, of playlists, your different types of video that you do. And branching out from that on the next layer is your social media, okay? So each point on this next layer is a different social media platform. And each of these are supporting each other as well. And the more you have in terms of branches or points, then the stronger your web will be. Okay? If you have a if you create your web with a core and just three different types of videos that you do, what the fuck are you pulling over for? and just three different types of videos that you do then it's going to be too narrow a web and it's not going to be strong enough, okay? and then you support that with the social media ones and the more social media ones you have the stronger that support's going to be as well so you can start off with your, with your three main ones, okay? Your, your Twitter, your Facebook, your Instagram but then find out how many others you can branch out off on you've got Reddit, you've got Pinterest, you've got StumbleUpon, you've got Tumblr which I'm going to start branching into as well so all of these layers are just supporting this core goal and if you create something like that because you've diversified your content and because you're supporting it with social media then you'll create a channel which is good and strong enough to weather any storm and that's what I mean by the web you've got a core supported by your playlist and your different types of videos supported by social media and then any other branches off that you want to do, affiliations, merchandising, sponsorship deals, Patreon, whichever, red light jumping cunt. And that is how you can create a strong channel and a good channel. And because it's so diverse, the content that you do, people will keep coming back. Let me know your thoughts below, guys. I just had this thought this morning. And uh, I think if we apply it to uh, our channels, then we can all create the strongest and best channels we can. And that's where I'm going to leave it. Thanks very much for watching. If you have any comments, please leave them below. If you want to see more of my shit, check it out over there. If you like this, then you know what to do. If you really like this, then you know what to do. For now though, ride safe. Peace the fuck out.